excuse my mouse but uh so yeah I just tried recording this video and my dumbass was to turn my mic back on but um welcome to Dennis this is a game I stumbled across on itch might have been game Joe, but I think it was itch but uh it's set in three days not, it's a horror game, but not like survival horror, horror, it's psychological slash cosmic, so you gotta like figure out the mystery kind of thing. I don't know if there's combat, I didn't really look into it that deep, I think it's just kind of one of those fucked up fucking, all those crazy shits going on kind of games, as you can see the fucking weird window in the back. Anyway, let's get into it. Oh yeah. Sorry, I'm kind of retarded. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's terrifying. My child. Hold on, let me, let me do that better. <clears throat> My child. Your flesh is a debt long overdue. I have given you the all fifth gift of life. And I just so easily take it from you. Three days from now, I will return to raise the earth of all those who walk upon it. Only then will the debt be repaid. Three days. The first dawn of the first day. No, I'm just kidding. It is kind of like Mr. Red Mask in that sense. But. I digress. What a nightmare. No, oh, wrong button. I wonder if everyone is okay. I better go check on them. Using this book, you can now save you can save your game. Save game. Game saved. It is now safe to turn off your system. That's nice. I like that. Are you okay? You sound like you're having a bad dream. A monster coming to eat us. Don't be silly. It was just a dream. Sure, Mom. What have you say, Mom? The girl next door came knocking for you. He seemed troubled by something. Maybe you should go check in on her. Maybe I should didn't. But I'm going to because it's going to progress things. As I walk into the door frame. Also, don't be too late coming home tonight. When you are done exploring for the day, come back and get up to bed. Who knows what tomorrow will bring. Okay, Mom. Whatever you say. I have a wicked bad itch on my shin right now. Like, right near my knee. Oof. Hey there, buddy. She's up in her room. She seems upset by something, but she won't tell me. Could you check on her for me? I'd really appreciate it. Great parenting. Can I tell us something in this town? The parents all suck. You came. I I had a weird dream, and I wasn't sure who to talk to. I'm still trying to make sense of it. What? You had one, too. I wonder if that means anything. I need to make sense of it all. You should see if any of the other kids had similar dreams. Maybe you should check in the library. I'm sure they have books about nightmares. How can one more than one person share a dream like that? Sorry to answer my, uh family member about something anyway I think I forgot to say that she said please don't tell my dad about all this but whatever it's not that important I mean and if y'all can read y'all clearly unless I hit it too fast I don't know whatever fuck it shit happens get the flower get the flower I don't know what they do but I'm gonna get the flower it's a flower I'll take it with me you have one flower Yay, one flower. 
Hey, you go right on up. He's in his room. Thank God you came. Look, man, I'm freaking out right now, and you're my best friend. I'm not sure who else to talk to. I had the scariest dream last night, and his voice spoke directly to me and told me he was going to kill us all. What? You had the same dream? How is that even possible? It was so real, man. What do we even do about this? Is there anything we can do? There's gotta be some sort of clue around the village. You gotta go see what you can find out. Someone has gotta know something. Just keep safe, man. Please let me know what you uncover. You got it, dude! Oh, another flower. No idea what the flowers do, but I'm gonna keep grabbing them. If you take anything from this library, please note it down in this book. You ready to say, sir? Hello there, welcome to the library. Please feel free to look through all our books. Bear in mind that we cycle our display books daily, so something new will be. Ooh, that's interesting. And neat for this style of game. We'll be able to read them out. Enjoy and let me know if you need anything. Sick! I'm looking for a book on dealing with laws. For my son, he just lost his first pet. He's pretty cut up about it, and I'm not sure what to do. Long ago in this village, there was a widespread hysteria about the second coming of a god. Police tore the village in half. Some believed that vehe vehemently that a greater power was coming. There were various reports of murders across the village, but no evidence was ever found. It is not known if a greater power arrived or not 15 years ago. Interesting. Apocalypticism. Views and movements that focus on the cryptic revelation by the sudden, dramatic, and catechismic intervention of a god in history, the judgment of all men, the salvation of the faithful, and the eventual rule of the new god. Huh, something is scribbled there. Hail Dennis. This game definitely interests the hell out of me. It is believed that people that frequently distressed by night that are frequently distressed by nightmares could be re-experiencing some stressful event from the past. Yeah, that's believable. I I'm looking for a book on nightmares. No reason. Yeah. Sketchbox. The sleep of reason produces nightmares. Sure. That makes sense. Where is it? Where is it? Ah, what do you want, kid? Can't you stand up busy here? Get out of here. Wait a minute, let me see something. I think he tried to follow me. Where is it? Where is it? Ah, right, kid, what do you want, kid? Can't you stand up busy here? Get out of here. Let's see what he does. I want to see what happens. I really do. Really, that it? Okay, you don't do anything else. It was worth a shot. I thought he might like try to kidnap me or something. You know what I mean? There's probably there's clearly something weird going on in this little village. There's another book here. Wait, it's completely blank. I'll take it with me. Blank book obtained. And that's it for the library, I suppose. This is where it leads out of town. I better not leave. Two flowers, I'll take it with me. You have three flowers. Yay, me. It's such a beautiful day when you get out of here, you fucking bug! Finally killed that fucking fly. I just like literally did a lap around my face while I'm trying to record.
God, I hate bugs. Anyway, it's such a beautiful day. When you get to our age, you learn to appreciate the little things. Like walks by the ocean. I appreciate that anyway. We are pretty much inseparable these days. Well, yeah, you're close. You're like three days from dying, so I would assume... I totally skipped what you said the second, but I don't even really care. But like I was saying, that three, you're three days away from dying, you're gonna... You're gonna die. We're all going to die, unless... I either stop it, or sacrifice myself, I, it, I don't know, I, I, I don't know how this is going to turn out. <laughs> it's a little weird that there's no music in the houses. Hey there little buddy, why the long face? I love this little beach house, it's the perfect place to come and chill if you had too much sun. And if I, I ain't out surfing, you can usually find me here or on the sand. Word, you have like nothing in your house but four couches and two tables. Fucking weirdo. Flower. We up to five flower boys. Okay, that's an upside down cross. I'm out. Yep, told you there's something weird going on in this village. Hello, Derry. Don't mind me. Just taking a walk to clear my head. No reason. You're having them too, aren't you? It's a flower. Take it with me. Six flowers. Whoa, you snuck up on me, that kid. Scared the life out of me. You go, you go careful playing around this pier. I don't want you falling in, you hear? Police station. Please, my son has been missing for days now, and you have done nothing to help. I don't know where else to turn. Sir, I have told you that we are trying everything that we can. We have our officers out now looking for him right we're out looking for him right now. I understand you are distressed, but I'm not sure what else to tell you. If you would like to take a seat there, you can wait until any more news becomes available. I don't know what to do. I miss my boy so much. He started hanging around with some real shady types, started spreading some nonsense about being watched. I don't know what he got himself into, involved in, but it sounded like some weird cult. He used to play around the mountains a lot. I just hope we can find him. Poor guy. There really isn't anything we can do to help him right now. If you see anything out there, be sure to let us know, okay? Hey kid, that way leads to their our jail cell. It's a real nasty piece of work in there currently. I would really advise against going in. There are multiple reports of missing people and several warnings of people behaving strangely around the town dressed in weird costume. Let's go check out this real piece of work. Thirty-seven. 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 Who are you? Which one of them sent you? I get out of here in two days, kid. And I'm gonna kill all of you. You hear? All of you. Two days, kid. You best get out of here. Cause when I get out, ain't no man or god will stop me. Whoa. Nobody move. We got a badass over here. I don't really- Ooh, we found the church. I hate this place. 
My best friend died and they wouldn't let him me bury him there. There's plenty of room. I had to lay him the rest close instead to here and said, it's not fair. Why did they have to treat him differently? He meant just as much to me as anyone else here. If there's some, there's some weird stuff going on in this church and they only care for themselves, screw them. Let's check out the church. Something isn't right about this church, and I'm gonna get to the bottom of it, even if it kills me, kid. I don't trust it. Keep an eye out for anything. <coughs> <coughs> you know, this building has more history than I think people realize. A little bit more than I can tell you. I need to sit in my drink. Hold on. Alright, we good. I didn't read really what he said at the last point, so whatever. Hello there, my child, and welcome to the church. Sometimes this building is the perfect place to come and sit and make your peace with the world. <coughs> come on, I just took a sip of my drink. I know that looking up at this stained glass puts me at ease. It's a symbol from the uh, title screen. Well, the new game screen, I should say. I could sit and stare at it forever, I bet you could. It's <coughs> <coughs> fucking cost pissing me off. There's something enveloping about it. Feel free to come by any time. What's that? A nightmare? It happens to us all, my child. In an unfortunate aspect of life. It cannot be helped. Thanks, Father. That's why I don't like charges. What's on the side of the church? Flowers. Seven flowers. Eight flowers. This road leaves out of time. Oh, okay. Oh shit, the school. Let's check it out. Oh, hello. The Jesus are here if you would like to talk to them about anything. Let's go to the left first. Huh? A weird nightmare. I mean, sure, who doesn't get nightmares? I didn't think too much of it. I don't want to be late for school. Yeah, okay, no kid thinks like that. Oh! Hello there. Feel free to take a seat. There's literally no one in this class. Welcome to Religious Studies. Today we are going to learn a little bit about our local church. The church is free to visit, and I definitely recommend going for a look yourself after class. The main room of the church is called a nave. In an honor, that's where you can see the fabulous stained glass windows. Stained glass was a very popular way of displaying messages of the holy text to those who couldn't read back then. Some say that the building itself has a series of tunnels and rooms that run beneath it, although I'm not sure if anyone has proven that. Ring! That went by a lot quicker than I thought it would. Guess that's up. Guess that's us for now. I think it's supposed to be all. Oh, it's probably just a typo. Feel free to swing by tomorrow for a little more, though. Interesting. So if all three of these like offshoot to classrooms, then how do you fit all of the information you can get? From it? Like how many stories are in each class? Like how like what well, lessons I should say? That might mean we're gonna have to do multiple playthroughs. There's nine flowers, sick boy. Playing fields. Yeah, these look sick. Looks like some link to the past. Yeah, this is my house. The Sierras and Falls. I said this waterfall comes straight from the sun above. No, it doesn't. There's no fucking way. Mountain path. Leads to the Mountain Top Cafe. Alright, let's check it out. Let's check out this weirdo first. What? Who are you? I'm not hiding. Look, they kicked me out. Just take this and come find me tomorrow. Team Mystery Key. Find me tomorrow. I have some stuff to work out. Okay then, you weirdo. That's probably one of the people I stress dreams, and I probably just got a pop plot point thing. 
Ten flowers? Ten flowers. I don't know if that has any effect on the ending or anything, but we'll see. Hello there, and welcome to my mountaintop coffee shop. Feel free to take a seat and enjoy the company. Hello there, love. What's that? A bad dream. It seems there's plenty of that going around. My little grandson was saying the same thing this morning. The thing about dreams is they can never really hurt you. It'll be fine. You'll grow up it before you know it. Take care, love. I hate working here. It'll all be for soon, I guess. Uh, I have a day off tomorrow. That's what I meant. I cannot wait. I'm gonna spend the day at the beach. And work on the sand. Maybe see you there. Hello there, thank you for coming all the way up to see us. It's been a beautiful day outside. You definitely shouldn't miss a chance to go up and check out the view. Might as well. See, I told you that it doesn't come from the sun, you fox. A door, huh? This rock is pretty well buried. May I find something to dig it out? There's a weird keyhole here. The mysterious key doesn't fit here. I guess it gets you somewhere else. Oh, that's cool as shit. Wait, what is that? Why does that look like a fucking giant eyeball? You know it's just the moon. Or sun, I guess. I have a feeling there's gonna be a pipe. It uh, it's gonna be a fucking eyeball. Like an actual eyeball. But I think that's all for day one. I'm pretty sure we went completely around the town. So... I think that might be all for day one. Yeah, we did. Okay. Wow. So to check out everything takes about 22 minutes, give or take. But, uh, yeah, let's end day one. Damn it. Oh, wait, that's not what I meant to do. For, not yet. That's what I meant to do. Time for bed? Yep. Oh boy. Not again! Mom? My child. Shh, shh. I'm here. I'm here. What the fuck? I'm always watching over you. It's okay. He will arrive soon. And when he does, we will return what he gave us. Hey, old Dennis. Wow! Okay. Okay. Alright. What the fuck? What is happening? Mom is linked to all this? Guess so, buddy. But, uh, on that note, I think this is a good spot to save and leave this part here because wow that was a that, what a twist <laughs> uh, uh, I'm pretty sure this has multiple endings so this will be a go running thing I'm kind of curious to see what the, if the flowers do or mean anything and I do want to know what's going on so expect more of this too but uh, with that being said I will catch you fine feathered folk in the next video peace out yo